Hi everyone out there on YouTube, it's David here from DP Computing. Today we've got an Asus F552E laptop. Now I just need to get in and image this hard drive, so I'll just show you a quick um, teardown or a basic teardown of how to get into the hard drive and hopefully the memory and a couple of other things in this system. Now as always, um, please follow these steps at your own risk and um, please take anti-static precautions. Um, if you damage your laptop or anything, I'm not responsible. Now the first thing you have to do is remove the power which is in here. So just remove that, then remove the battery. Before we go on, as I said, this is a Asus F552E. It's got an AMD quad core 2.0 gig, uh, 4 gig of RAM, 750 gig hard drive. It's got Windows 8 and a Radon HD 8670M video, which is 1 gig. So I said remove the um, power and then remove the battery which is here to remove the battery just push that one out until you see a little red mark now the one on this side you have to hold out and then just slide it out so there's the battery see if we can get a model number probably not clear enough there but I'll read it out to you it's just a lithon lithium iron battery pack and the model is A41-X550A and it's a 14.4 volt 37 watt so just see if we can see that there no it doesn't like to focus today ah oh, there we go there's all the details there now I presume the hard drive is under this panel here which is held in by two screws so just undo those two screws now find the screwdriver just got a standard, I think it's a number one Phillips head screwdriver here. The screws just pull out. And looks like there's just two screws holding in this back panel. Now the panel will slide off, so just push it um, downwards. And there we go. And as you can see here, we've got the hard drive, which is in a little caddy, um, memory there, and an SD card slot. So it looks like the memory that's already on this machine is soldered on, and we can just got room for one more dim in there. Now the hard drive itself is held in by four screws, so one, two, three, and that screw is empty because it's one that holds in the cases or that cover panel as well. So that one's already removed. We've just got another three to remove. Now these are slightly shorter than the ones on the panel, so just remember which ones go where. And we've got a little plastic tab here, if you can see it. So just pick that up and push it outwards, and there we go. There's the hard drive itself, it's in a little metal caddy, again that's held in by four screws, so they're just Phillips head screws, they're a bit shorter again, so there's actually three types of screws in this laptop to get to the hard drive, just remember the shorter ones are into the hard drive caddy, the medium sized ones are to hold the caddy into the hard drive, into the laptop I should say and the longer ones that hold the back panel on. So once those four screws are removed, just tip it up and there we've got the hard drive. So you can then um, replace that hard drive with a SSD, a larger hard drive or whatever you want. And to put it all back, it's just reverse of what we've done. So put it that way. So make sure the connectors are facing that little plastic tab screw it all in and then slide it in so there you have it there's a quick teardown of an Zeus F552e laptop thank you for watching and please like my channel and check out our other videos on our channel thanks a lot and I'll catch you next time bye for now